A lot of you by now will know that I suffer from an anxiety disorder. Specifically, post-traumatic stress disorder, or PTSD. Don't worry, it's very well handled and I'm in control. However, that was only after literal years of therapy and psychologist visits. It took me even more years just to get off my anti-anxiety medications. And for that matter, I'm one of the lucky ones. I actually could get off of my anti-anxiety medications. Many people that suffer from anxiety disorders just won't ever get off of their medications because they need those medications to function normally. I guess, in a sense, I'm trying to give you a little background knowledge on why I'm angry right now. Because I am. I'm very angry. Because you know what doesn't fix an anxiety disorder? A freaking blanket. Because for today's project, we have Gravity, the weighted blanket for sleep, stress, and anxiety. Fun fact, a polo shirt plus this comforter, not actually as comfortable as you'd think. 70% of Americans have trouble falling asleep at least one night a week. It's never been harder to turn off our minds, completely unplug, and reach a deep relaxation and restfulness that we actually need. Introducing Gravity, a weighted blanket engineered to be 10% of your body weight to naturally reduce stress and increase relaxation through deep pressure stimulation. Now, that sounds like bullshit, right? How can just adding weight to your body calm you down? Well, the funny thing is, it actually does. Currently, weighted blankets are being used in many therapy environments with some serious results. As a matter of fact, According to the Journal of Medical and Biological Engineering, weighted blankets were even shown to calm a person down while they were at a dentist appointment. Keep in mind, the guys behind the study did state that it could just be a placebo effect, but for something like this, that doesn't matter. Placebo is fine. If it gets results, it gets results. It does calm people down. Whether it's placebo or not just means it might not work on some people. So the question now becomes, why did I decide to do a video on this project if it's a working product? We'll get to that in just a little bit. Over the last year, we've studied the incredible science and medical research about the positive effects that weighted blankets can have on serious conditions like PTSD, insomnia, OCD, and serious forms of anxiety. This is critical because 40 million people in the country suffer from prolonged anxiety. That is 18% of the country. And so we wanted to take this science and design a product that could help everyone. Each gravity blanket is tailored to represent about 10% of your body weight. It evenly distributes pressure across your body while you rest. By stimulating these pressure points, gravity blanket increases serotonin and melatonin levels while decreasing cortisol levels. Learning! The bullshit levels are at maximum capacity! I can't believe this! I get to do it again! Bullshit alert! Bullshit alert! Bullshit alert! God, I missed that! No! There is no scientific study that states that serotonin and melatonin get raised while cortisol gets lowered while under the effects of a weighted blanket. Again, the one study that I could actually find supporting your claims and that I actually agreed with still stated that it could just be a placebo effect. There are no scientific studies that state that melatonin, serotonin, or cortisol are ever affected by a weighted blanket. That right there is just a false claim. Even the studies that you claim support your product don't claim any interaction with any known hormones. And you know what? While we're at it, let's take a look at those studies. This study simply took a look at 75 different people under psychological care and studied them. It then concluded that those that tried a weighted blanket reported a decrease in their stress and anxiety. Now, if that doesn't sound like a real study, that's because it isn't. But while that's bad enough, it actually gets worse. The study itself wasn't blinded. That means that the people being questioned could have just reported a decrease in stress because the researchers made them expect it. And on top of that, people that weren't using a weighted blanket also reported a drop in symptoms. Basically, what I'm getting at is, this study ain't shit. That's not how science works, you dingbat! So now I probably have you saying, Alright, detective, great video, you're awesome, you're amazing, and I love you. But the blanket's not really harmful. 
I mean, sure, they're using some really crappy science to back up their blanket, but that's not really gonna hurt anyone, is it? It's probably a really comfortable blanket, so let them pass, you know? And I would have. Honestly, I like this product. It looks pretty comfortable, and I love me a comfy blankie. But this campaign could kill people. And now you'll probably be saying, all right, all right, tell me how asbestos is inside the blanket and let's move on with our lives. No, the blanket itself is completely safe. Seriously, I actually want this blanket, I'm not gonna lie to you. The part that can kill people is the campaign itself. They're arguing for you to pick this blanket over getting treatment and medications, specifically prescriptions. As a matter of fact, they go so far as to claim that this blanket will treat multiple mental disorders. Oh. Wait a minute, that's the Wayback Machine. You're right, because they actually removed that claim because it's against Kickstarter terms of service to kickstart a medical treatment. But they only did this after they raised three million dollars. I'm done, I'm done, I can't handle this. You have a nice day, guys. I have a nap to take.